The Pentagon believes that the Marine Corps' new CH-53K King Stallion heavy lift helicopter, which at $144 million apiece, costs more than a notoriously expensive F-35A Lightning II Joint Strike Fighter, is the most powerful helicopter the United States has ever fielded. Unfortunately the pricey helo may not see action downrange anytime soon due to a growing list of worrying technical problems. The King Stallion which first landed in the hands of Marines back in May 2018, may not achieve initial operational capability. As soon as Navy official originally expected, officials told Vertical magazine in a January 10th interview first noticed by her friends at the war zone. Discovery of technical issues later than expected. An inadequate rate of their closure resulted in a flight test efficiency rate that was less than projected. Naval Air Systems Command. Spokesman Greg Kuntz told the magazine in a statement. We are evaluating requirements to the program but have not yet made a formal determination on IOC. While the CH-53K program has racked up an eye-popping $31 billion price. Tag since the start of development in 2006. The persistence of technical flaws revealed in operational testing are concerning to say the least. A January 2018 report from the Pentagon Operational Test. Evaluation Office detailed numerous structural problems in the airframe. Problems exacerbated by a lack of needed parts. In April 2018 Pentagon officials told Bloomberg News they were monitoring. Wards of 1,000 current or projected. Mission impacting technical issues that present a high risk to the airframe. Those problems include major deficiencies in the main rotor gearbox. Unreliable flight speed indications. Overheating of essential propulsion elements, anomalies in the tail boom design. And as Bloomberg News later noted, exhaust gas sucked back into the engine. All issues which pose major obstacles to the lifespan and survivability requirements that necessitated the CH-53K program in the first place.